hello everyone happy friday so i'm back with another video i don't know what possessed me to get on this hair app and show off my ugly toes but spring is coming well spring is here and summer's coming so i just felt like i just throw up a little pedicure video i didn't show the full thing um i do have a full video of me doing a pedicure um diy at home somewhere on this channel so i'll plug it in later on but um yeah so i haven't done my toes since like february so i was like it's time plus i'm going to jenny secrets event on sunday in the boogie down bronx so um i plan to wear like some open toe shoes so i um, definitely wanted to have my toes somewhat looking decent for that so i decided to go in with a french pedicure for my toes um i went in with rubber base coat this is from nails cat cat in the clear i think it's sold out and i'm like ugh, because i do need some more but i use this um i use this rubber base coat a lot so yeah i just went in with one coat of the rubber base coat and then i went in with shiny glitter painting gel from born pretty although born pretty we, we had like they called me a different name in the email when i was working for them um i do like their products a lot they have really good products i probably won't spend my money on it but um these the painting gel with some of the products that they had sent me to review so later on you'll see it um, pop up on the screen when I get to that part uh, this was very hard <laughs> trying to record myself doing French on my toes like doing pe a pedicure is hard in general but then you try to record it and then you try to do French so I did mess up on this foot I didn't leave that in because this video is like very short and it's simple right to the point so um if you see like different angles sorry it was very hard trying to record this but i still wanted to record it so ladies let's get those toes done whether you have those pretty instagram feet or whether you got toes like mine that just be looking crazy with marks all on them however get them toes ready for the summer it's about to be sandal season so yeah um that's what i'll be doing this weekend they're supposed to, um, sorry y'all, the pollen is like very high and I was starting to cough. I didn't want to be coughing all in this voiceover, but, um, they're supposed to be doing like free nails. I was going to do my nails for Sunday, but I was like, why not get my nails done for free? It's been literally five years since I, um, step foot in a nail salon to get my nails done i'm not even gonna say like nail salon i'm gonna say the chop shop like let's keep it a buck i used to go to the chop shop right around um the corner from my house there were two now there were two um chop shops pretty much right across from each other and then there was one further up nail salons whatever you want to be pol politically correct so when one would piss me off i would go across the street and then um i eventually got really cool with this girl who did nails her name was sasa like she um really did my nails to like how i wanted i never had issues when um she was doing my nails but then she wound up moving like 20 minutes away to a different nail salon and I was so heartbroken. Um, she did like recommend other people to do my nails, but they just mm -mm, didn't do it like her. <laughs> so yeah, um, the last time someone did my nails was pretty much 2018. And the last time I got a pedicure in the nail salon was 2019, um, probably before I gave birth to my um, last child. My youngest child i always like get a pedicure before i go into labor and i don't know the lady did something to my toes and i was bleeding it hurt so bad and i kept telling her stop i think at one point i not kicked her on purpose but because i kept telling her stop and the pain was just so bad i think i like jerked my foot and wound up kicking her so yeah sorry about that but i did kept telling her stop <laughs> so anyway that's the last time anybody has touched my nails or my feet so i decided that i'm not gonna do my nails and i'm just gonna um see what they have to offer on sunday and 
um, try to get my nails done by somebody from Jenny's crew. So, um, yeah, that's very exciting. I can't wait. But I definitely wanted to have my little Piggly Wigglies done for that day. Um, yeah, so next week video, I'm finally going to unbox my stuff from Natalie Carmana or Get Nailed 32. I've ordered from her for a while now and... I just have the stuff sitting in the package, but I definitely want to open everything up. I'm hoping the weather is nice because I did get acrylic so that I can go on my balcony and like um, start, you know, starting to get the hang of acrylic. I'm really excited. Can't wait for you guys to see it. So it's going to be like a two part video. It's going to be like me unboxing and then me attempting to do acrylic. I'm not going to do acrylic on um, like actual nail tips i bought the mat where you can practice that i guess like they have in school so i'm gonna start off with that and really get the hang of that and try to master that before i start working on like my practice hand or whatever whatever so yeah this video is about to be over i just added my top coat sorry the frames are a little um like lopsided it's because the way i was recording but anyway so also y'all a prey the CEO that got fired and then this other girl that got fired uh, on TikTok. I don't know if y'all be on TikTok, but you might want to get on TikTok. And if you are a Prey fan, you might want to consider because they are spilling tea on what is going on behind the scenes about the diversity, about the work overload. It is getting real out here how like celebrity nail techs don't want to work with them anymore because they don't pay them and how certain nail techs are like, on the bottom of the barrel they only get picked because the celebrity nail techs don't want to work they are spilling tea so if y'all like me who wanted to buy your praise but couldn't afford it and then you know was saving up to buy it and then all this stuff came out about them firing the ceo and founder and now this other girl who used to work with them is coming out it's a lot so yeah you might want to Go watch that on Twitter. <laughs> I mean, TikTok. But um, yeah, that's it for this video. I hope you guys have a great weekend. See you in the next one. Be good to you. Be good to others. Bye.